here with your girl, Angeline Smalls, where all we do is talk about hair. Of all the hairstyles we know and love, a sleek ponytail is an ode to the classic hairstyle. As simple as ponytail may sound, I am here to show you four new innovative ways to wear your ponytail in 2017. The Modern Ponytail series will be showcasing four new and trend-setting ways to wear one of society's most go-to hairstyles. Today's episode is all about the Bardo Bang High Ponytail. The items you will need will be your hair scrunchie, your gel of your choice, a styling wax bobby pins, your choice of an eight inch wefted hair for the bangs and your choice of drawstring ponytail. So let's begin and show you how to create this beautiful look. So you may be asking yourself, what makes a ponytail so special? A basic definition of a ponytail is a high, is a hairstyle in which the hair is drawn back and tied at the back of the head, causing it to hang down like a pony's tail. To get the perfect ponytail, it's all about the physics. The crucial characteristic for the perfect ponytail is the elasticity, density, and curliness, which essentially tells how springy a piece of hair is, plus the length of the ponytail. The Bardo Bang is a trend we will definitely see throughout 2017. Now let's start with our model as she's sitting right here. As you can see, her hair is pulled back, sleek and tight ponytail. And today we are gonna be adding bangs and her ponytail for this fabulous look. Continue tuning in with their girl, Angeline Smalls owner of Anti Salon and Spa, and your host of Talk That Hair. So this is your eight inches of wefted hair. This is her bangs where we'll, we will be creating on our model's hair. So if you have lengthy hair, you do want to get a wefted hair to create bangs and sleek your hair back into the ponytail so you do not have to cut any inches off your hair. So this is the trick to having bangs without cutting your natural hair. You're watching Talk That Hair with your girl, Angeline Smalls. So we're gonna be creating bangs. You do want to measure how wide you want your ponytail to be. And as you measure, you do want to cut each piece. And just so we can go a little bit faster, we're gonna cut a few pieces at the same length. And the first three pieces will be the same length and going further back, you'll have shorter pieces. Now, the inspiration behind this unique hairstyle is the iconic fashion icon, Bridget Bardo. All right, so here we go. We have the three pieces here of the bang that we're creating. So you need your glue. You wanna go right ahead and add your glue on. Make sure this is open first of all. Is there any glue coming out? Yes, there is. So make sure you put enough glue on each wefted hair. As you can see, and we're gonna place that in the area, area we would like her bangs to be. And that's her first piece of bang. Use your hairspray. Dries a lot faster with hairspray so you don't have to use your blow dryer that often. So we're gonna to proceed to repeat the same steps. And if you put too much glue, just spread it along the rest so you do not waste any of the glue or have it become too messy. Now, depending on how thick you would like your bangs to be, or how thin is determined by how many pieces of bangs, pieces you would put in your hair. So in our models here, we're not sure of how uh, wide and how full we want her bangs to be, rather yet how full, but as you go, you can determine if it's good enough or not. You're watching Talk That Hair with your girl, Angeline Small owner of the entire salon spot and your host 
of talk back here. Now the flared fringe bangs that I'm creating in four plates, a lot of teasing layers, and more importantly, long wispy bangs that are parted in the center to keep focus on the eye. So you will see what I'm, uh, the bangs that I'm creating right now is exactly for that look. All right, so the further you go back on the bangs, the shorter the width of hair becomes because you want to make sure before model hold their head down for a second so you can see you want to make sure going back to the ponytail these pieces become more narrow so you can be more in line with the ponytail you don't want the bang wrap to be so wide because as you go directly up to this ponytail you want to make sure it's even and in the same go in the same direction as the ponytail. You don't want it too wide the higher you go. So you'll see as I am going further up on our model's bangs. All right, so this is a great time of year to wear ponytails. Perfect weather, not too cold, not too hot. This is the perfect time of year for that. Very easy, and ponytails are just very sassy and very clean and can be worn for any occasion, depending on the ponytail. So do not forget, we're having four themes of this ponytail series, very classic ponytails. We're doing four weeks of the series, four episodes each week. So today is our first episode of this four-week series. You're watching Talk Back Here with your girl, Angeline Smalls. All right. So as we are almost finished with gluing our model's bangs on, let me give you some tips on how to remove this glue. Glue doesn't necessarily take your hair out. It all depends on how well you remove them. You have to remove them in a safe way. And a safe way to remove these is to use oil sheen, oil sheen each and every track, or condition each and every track. Let it sit. And after it sits for a while, you sort of uh, play around with it, which is you mess with the wafted area just to loosen up the glue from your hair and it will slide right off. And then of course you can wash the hair with lukewarm water so it can slide right out. And from then on, the rest of the glue that's on your hair, you can remove that with conditioner. You're watching Talk Back Hair with your girl in the small. So that's the tips on how to remove that glue. All right, so we're down to about five pieces I already put on her hair. So we're gonna do two more pieces, cut her bangs, and put on our model's drawstring ponytail. You're watching Talk Back Hair with your girl, Angeline Smalls. So we thank you for tuning in with us every Tuesday at 6 p.m. broadcasting live and also at 2 p.m. as well. So we are broadcasting live every Tuesday at 2 and 6 p.m. live. All right, so we have one more piece to go after this. All right. You guys loving this hairstyle? Go ahead and give us a call at 845-559. 0033 and you can book that appointment and come on in and get this amazing ponytail that we are doing today on our show we have four weeks of ponytails now working here at Antares salon and spa we have many ladies who come in and ask for ponytails but it always seems to be the same ponytails whether it's straight wavy but it's either like back or just with bangs. Today we are kicking it up a notch. We are going very classic with the ponytails and we have four weeks so you do not want to miss our next three episode of this series simply because you will be witnessing many, many different ways to do your beautiful classic ponytails that you're not going to see many people wearing. All right, so 2017 we're doing the trending ponytails and Today is the first episode of our first week series. Continue tuning in with us. And if you want to see beautiful pictures of our models here, please go ahead and go on to our Instagram, which is Talk That Hair. And if you would like to see any past episodes, 
go on to our YouTube and that would be the entire salon and spa. All right, so before I go ahead and cut or style, we're gonna blow dry that a little bit just so we can make sure it's secure and fully dry with the glue. All right. So we didn't need to blow dry that too much because we used our hairspray, which gives us a fast drying. Now we're gonna go ahead and cut her bangs. I did not use too many pieces because we don't need too much of a full bang. We wanna go very risky bangs. And to cut your bangs and to frame the face, the key thing is to cut in bangs to frame the face. You wanna gather all the bangs together. Once you have all your bangs in your hands, you go ahead and you twist the bang. Once you twist the bang, you determine how high or how low you would like the bangs to be. And I like bangs right in the bridge of the nose, so you eyeball the section of where you'll be cutting her bangs. Right at the eyeball. Cut all the way through. And then you wanna go ahead and Shape the bang. I'm gonna have our model lean forward. Point cut bangs will give you more of a wispier bang. That creates creates a very pointy, wispy look that's not a blunt. We're trying to get away from the blunt bangs, trying to create more of a softer look. Pointy bangs give more of a softer bang and better framing of your face, depending on the look you're going for. And that is it, just how it is. And we're gonna point cut this side as well. You're watching Talk That Hair with your girl, Anthony Smalls, owner of the Entire Salon Spa and your host of Talk That Hair. All right, so have our model holder up so you can see how beautiful are these bangs. Check her out. She looks amazing, look at me. Beautiful. Bangs look so good on you, you're perfect for these bangs. And that's how you can create some beautiful, nice, wispy bangs without cutting your hair. And we're gonna slightly curl these bangs. So you wanna start at the sides. Slightly hit the tips with the iron, have them cool off, and then you drop those bangs. Repeat the same steps. You do not need to do a tight curl. You want to slightly bump the ends so you can see. If you can zoom in at that end, you can see. Take a good look. As I bump the ends slightly, you can see the different lengths in the bangs and gives you that wispy look. That's what gives you that soft look on the ends of your bangs. Check her out, she's looking so beautiful. Let those bangs cool before we drop them on her forehead. How gorgeous is she looking? And let's do the other side to complete the beautiful wispy bangs. We thank you all for tuning in every Tuesday at 2 and 6 p.m. live. For those who are just tuning in, you're watching Talk That Hair with your girl, Angeline Smalls. We're doing a full week series on ponytails, classic ponytails you will find right here on Talk That Hair. This series was requested by a few clients. I'm trying to see what kind of ponytail they would like to wear. So we're doing a show based on a request from a couple of our viewers and clients who thought we should do a show on ponytail. So here we are today for those who have requested and want to see a uh, beautiful ponytail hairstyle 
We're doing that right here on Talk That Care with Antoine Smalls every Tuesday at 2 and 6 p.m. live. All right, so now we have our bangs. Let's turn her around so you can see how beautiful she looks with the bangs before we go ahead and complete this hairstyle. All right, so this is how your bangs should look. Check that out. How beautiful are these bangs. Check them out. She looks amazing. Now let's complete our hairstyle. Now you would need your drawstring ponytail or your wefted hair is just as good as your drawstring ponytail. We're using a drawstring because it's a lot quicker on our shelf, but I would, I prefer the wefted hair, but a drawstring does the job as well. So you want to go ahead and insert the comb in front of your bun and there's also a comb in the back as well you're going to go ahead and insert the comb in the back and then you want to draw the string that's why it's called a drawstring draw the string very tight and you want to go ahead and wrap that around so it's hidden and you cannot see that it's a drawstring and you use your hairpin and pin the drawstring underneath so it's nicely pinned. And you're watching Talk That Hair with your girl, Angeline Small. So before we go ahead and finish her hairstyle, we want to give it a clean look. So I like to have hair wrapped around my ponytails. So it gives a tighter seam look right here at the ponytail where the bun is. So you want to grab hair. Depends on the amount of hair you grab, the tighter this section will be and the higher the ponytail will be. So you want to go ahead and wrap this amount of hair that I already put aside to cover anything that's exposed or create a tighter ponytail look at the root area. Check that out. Then you want to go ahead and use your hairpin and secure that. And we're not done because I think with this look we would like to see more of the waves on the side. So we're going to go ahead and pull some of these waves out. We're going to pull them both to the side. We have it to this side. We have it to both sides. I don't like too much of a wave, so we're gonna pull the waves out and have it become more of a semi wave, not too much of a tight wave. To give that look. Check that out. Beautiful for the fall. Great idea for those who are at home and thinking about a ponytail and what to do this is definitely a perfect look for you how gorgeous does our model look she looks beautiful we're gonna go ahead and pin the back a little bit so we can create more waves on the sides You're watching Talk That Care with your girl, Angeline Smalls. We thank you guys for tuning in with us every Tuesday at 2 and 6 p.m. Broadcasting live from 381 Main Street, Poughkeepsie, New York, right here in the beautiful Hudson Valley. We're located at 381 Main Street. You guys would like to come in and get this hairstyle if you do not think you could do this at home yourself. Give us a call at 845 559-0033. All right, we're almost finished and I know you guys cannot wait to see her before picture because you guys are definitely witnessing her very after. How gorgeous is this beautiful look or model looking so beautiful. Check 
that out. All right, looks like her model. She is looking beautiful. So do not forget to follow us on our Instagram, which is Talk That Hair. And do not forget to go on to our YouTube channel, which is Antirese Salon and Spa. Doesn't her model look breathtaking? I love doing a modern twist to such a classic and elegant hairstyle. Now we do see our model's wonderful after, but we cannot forget about what she looked like before. Check out our model after. And here is her before, because here is her iconic after. Check her out. How gorgeous is she? And here are some beautiful images from today's show. The Bardo High Bang Ponytail. Smalls, those images were definitely a work of art. And here is the Talk That Hair 360, ladies. Are you guys ready for that Talk That Hair 360? Check out our model. Here she is, everybody. She's doing that 360 Talk That Hair. Here we go. How beautiful is this wonderful bang? Here she is, everybody. Check her out. All right, so we will see you next week for another episode of Talk That Hair, the ponytail series. Next week, we will be all about the pom-pom hairstyle. You do not want to miss the pom-pom hairstyle next week, ladies. Check us out next week at 2 and at 6 p.m. live. We'll see you next week. Bye.